Welcome to the Slop Farm. Enjoy the video. We're going to walk through the simple steps to get your ZTE router back to its optimal state. A factory reset can resolve many frustrating Wi-Fi problems, from sluggish performance to a completely unresponsive network. It's also essential if you've forgotten your admin password and can't access the settings. By following these steps, you'll restore stability and default security settings quickly, making your home network reliable again. Before proceeding, it's crucial to know that all personalized settings, like your custom Wi-Fi network name, password, and port forwarding rules, will be permanently deleted. You'll need to reconfigure these from scratch after the reset is complete. Ensure you have access to any ISP-provided login information or network details. This preparation prevents potential frustration and ensures a smooth re-establishment of your home network. Most ZTE routers feature a small, recessed reset button designed to prevent accidental presses. You'll typically find this tiny hole on the back panel, near the power port, or sometimes on the underside of the device. Grab a straightened paper clip, a small pin, or a toothpick to access this button. Make sure your router is powered on and fully booted up before you proceed to the next step. Once you've located the button and have your tool ready, insert the paperclip into the hole and press gently but firmly. You need to hold it down consistently for a duration of approximately 10 to 15 seconds. Keep an eye on the router's LED indicator lights during this period. They will usually flash, change color, or briefly go dark before the router restarts. This indicates the factory reset has been successfully initiated. After releasing the button, your router will automatically restart, which typically takes anywhere from one to three minutes to complete. Once all the lights stabilize, connect to the default Wi-Fi network using the credentials printed on a sticker, often on the bottom of the device. Then open a web browser and navigate to 192, 168, 1. One to log in with the default username, admin, and password admin to set up your new network. Thanks for watching. Consider subscribing if we helped you today.